This is the hexi tool, the hexi ruler, that has the ability to cut full hexagons up to seven and a half inches and indeed half hexagons, including the seam allowance. You will find that full instructions actually come with the template. To cut your full hexagons, decide on the height of your hexagons. That is the difference distance from one side to the other. I've cut a three and a half inch strip. Place the template on the fabric so that the three and a half inch lines fit exactly on the edge of the fabric. Taking a rotary cutter, or indeed you could draw a line and cut with scissors, cut up one side of the template and the other side. When you've done that, turn the fabric over, bring the ruler in from the left hand side and realign it with the edges of the fabric. Cut again up the sides of the ruler and there you will have a perfect hexagon. And you could cut hexagons up to seven and a half inches from a really small one inch finished one up to a seven and a half inch raw edge to raw edge or seven inches finished. Not only can you cut hexagons with this, which you could use for all your hexagonal designs, like the grandmother's flower garden, you could consider playing with it. For instance, if you took a striped strip of fabric stitched together and cut, say, six hexagons out of it, you could arrange these in an interesting pattern. And depending on how you wanted the pattern to look would be how you arrange the various hexagons. And of course, in the middle, you could easily put just a plain hexagon. So the hexagon side of the ruler has the ability to cut whole hexagons, but that's not all, because it also does half hexagons. To cut half hexagons, decide on the size of your half hexagons. Let me just cut a straight end, then you can see exactly how it works. Using the half hexagon tool, Place the half hexagon tool on the fabric so that the three and a half inches is aligned with the edge of the fabric. So the three and a half inches is there and the black line is on the edge of the fabric because that's your seam allowance line. This is the center of the template that adds your seam allowance on. Notice it's aligned with the three and a half inches there. Cut up the edge of the template turn the fabric over, slide the template in from the left-hand side, realign it with the measurements. There it is, three and a half inches here, the black lines running along the edge, and then cut up the side of the template. You can use your half hexagons for a variety of different designs. For instance, you could put them together and sort of plait them in a plaited type design. You could also use them to make up something like the inner city, which is composed of triangles that are also displayed here. So these are nothing more complicated than three half hexagons cut out and put together to form a 60 degree triangle. And you sew them together like that to form the 60 degree triangle, which is also the basis for the inner city design, which you can see now. So here we have the hexi tool which does your whole hexagons and your half hexagons.